Okay guys, this is Jimmy Chickie from Keller Williams Realty Southwest and today what we're going to talk about is referrals. How do we get referrals and how do we send referrals or find referrals inside the Keller Williams ecosystem. Um, the first thing we do is we go to kwconnect.com, kwconnect.com, okay? When you sign in, you're not going to see uh, a picture or anything in the corner. This tells you that you're not logged in. And just remember, if you're not logged in, these menus will change a little bit depending on whether you're able to log in or not. The idea is that even if you're not a Keller Williams agent, you can still take advantage to see what we're up to. But if you are a Keller Williams agent, we're going to allow you to dig in and get more information. So the first thing we're going to do is log in. All right. Once we log in, and then it's going to go to my profile picture. Oops, we got to actually log in. Look at that, you guys. All right, let's remember it next time. So I'm logging in. Uh, the first thing we're going to see is my profile. I'm going to click on just the KW logo back there. That'll take me back to the home screen. Okay. Now, for referrals, oh, by the way, one quick note. Because I've logged in, do you see how my picture showed up there? So that's one clue to let you know if you've logged in or not. We're going to concentrate here on the referral section. So let's just click on that. And the idea is, let's imagine somebody has called us and said, hey, um, I uh, need to sell my house in um, Burlington, Texas. All right. How do I find an agent in Burlington, Texas? All right. So what I do is I go down to this red button here in the corner that says grow my network. And let's click on that. So we have to find an agent over here in Texas. How do we do that? We go up into this little window in the upper right hand, uh, upper left hand corner, and let's type in Burlinson. Burlinson. I can't spell Burlinson. Listen. Well, there it is, Burlinson, Texas. Ta da! There you go. And it's going to zoom on and find a bunch of green dots. What are these green dots? These are actually sales inside the area. If you look up here in the upper left hand corner it says production. Um, that's not really going to help us. Let's look for market centers. So we're going to click on market centers and there we go. We see in the very center right there in Burlington is a market center which is great. If I click on that you'll start to see all the names over there. Okay. Uh, just one quick thing. I'm going to show you something. Um, if I zoom out you'll see and you start to see other market centers. See how the number changes from 1006? If I move around and get more market centers in there, you'll see that number go. So this number changes depending on how many market centers we can see. I'm going to go back down here to the plus. We're going to zoom back into Burlington, and this is telling me that there's 206 agents. Okay, um, so first thing we did, we're looking at market centers. We've clicked on it. The other thing we do is see how it's sorting by random? I switch that over to usually closed units, okay? So this is gonna tell me at the top of the list the agents that have done the most. So we see Shelly Green at the top. She's done 266 closed units. Because we see the green team below it, we can see that she is on that team and probably the Rainmaker. Joy Rap or J Rap, sorry, uh, is a single agent. So if I wanted to add either of these two to my list, I just slide my cursor over and either invite them to my network, or if I want to send them a, a referral right away, I just send them the referral. Um, one last thing, this little triangle right there, if I click down on the triangle, it does give her contact information so we can contact them and find out if it's a fit for our clients. Okay. Um, one other thing that's kind of interesting, I'm just going to close this window for a second, um, is that you can, you can narrow the search. You can say, let's go up here to the closed units button and let's say, give me only the agents that have done at least six deals in the past 12 month period. I click on the filter button and you can see we go from 200 down to 58. Now, because I've used some criteria up here, this button over here, the broadcast referral button has changed and now it's red. So if I want, I can actually send this referral to all 58 agents in the Burlington office that have closed at least six transactions. And I do that just by clicking on the red button. So uh, then you're sending a, a, you're broadcasting referral out and whoever responds, you can decide 
which of those people you like. You can also search by Keller Williams special, um, specializations. So if I just want MAPS coaching clients, I can do that, okay? So that's how I find referral partners in different offices. I hope you found this video helpful.